Drivers got to test the limits on their Jeeps today. People of all ages and experience levels hit the muddy trails for some off-roading fun. It was all a part of a fundraiser to benefit military families. I bought my first Jeep back in 78, and I've always had a Jeep since. Scott Sperling was one of more than 200 drivers who took to the trails out in South Whitley. He says he's been off-roading for more than 30 years. I love it. It's just a, a part of our family and this and that, you know. Uh, I build them and play with them and uh, just enjoy being around people and talking to them about it. Off-roaders made their way through several obstacles throughout the trails. We brought out two of the cars so that they could drive over the car, the mud pit, uh, the hill climbs. It was just a great place to come out here and just experience what the Jeep can do. Uh, it was great. There was families out here, a lot of hooting and hollering. Later, people headed over to the Allen County Fairgrounds for an after party. We've got the uh, kids rides, we've got a monster truck demonstration, we've got off-road uh, things, food, fun. It's a fun way to help those who serve our country. We've got so many active military in our uh, community that uh, sometimes need some help with one thing or another. Uh, Associated Churches has the Military Families Fund that uh, really helps those people out in need. So it's a great cause and we love to do it. Organizers expect to raise $30,000 from today's event. Over the last 10 years, the event has raised more than $100,000 for local military charities. Angelica Robinson, News Channel 15.